our Country Christian Witness Band. This is their 14th appearance, and it's Ed Hunt, Gene Nelson, Gene Ruby, and Steve Zeick. And they're going to be performing a country gospel medley. Let's give them a warm welcome. looking at the wrong list. I can see that you're not the country Christian witness band, but let's give, let's give Ed a warm welcome. Oh my gosh, one more interruption. This is Jim Hodges. I got here this morning, I never met Debbie, and she met me at the door, and she said, oh, I know you. She says, you're the one who has a daughter with all the kids, and your wife drives a jag. That's true. The kids are all put away in the garage, you know, but the jag's always the other way around. <laughs> I have five minutes. My song is only three minutes, so I have to fill up some space, or else there's a trap door here. I wonder why is that guy wearing a hat inside? Well, there's a story to this hat, and believe it or not, it's a true story. We have a friend named Catherine whose mother lives in Oshkosh. Catherine's mother, father died a few years ago. And she arranged for me to stay at her beautiful Victorian home up there in the air show. I stayed there this summer with three foreigners, two of them from Australia and one from Texas. And I had a very nice room all to myself as I put my clothes away. Catherine's mother saw me admiring this hat. So when I left, she gave me this hat. It was a really nice hat. But I didn't dare wear it until I talked to my friend Catherine and, and asked her if I ever wore Dad's hat. And Catherine said, well, I'm, I'm very pleased that somebody who's going to appreciate it is to wear that hat. And so it was fine to wear the hat. So two weeks later, at the same jam session, she corners me and she says, but when you die, I want the hat back. And that's a true story. The other true story is, of course, you might have noticed that my name wasn't announced in the newspaper. Diane said, Jim, considering your age compared to the other people here, she says, and we are so concerned with telling the truth in the paper, she says, you might not actually live that long. So she said, we'll announce you at the show. Somebody is going like this, I wonder what that means. I don't have no idea. Plug your guitar in. Are those the sweet voices of angels? 
Thank you. 